The Great Movie Ride, one of the most beloved attractions in Disney Parks history, closed in 2017 only to be replaced by Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway in March 2020. After closure, the interior was gutted and was completely cleared out. So what remains of The Great Movie Ride? What animatronics and props are left? To answer that question, let's take a magical journey through the movies. After the great movie ride closed, some of the props were gifted, sold, scrapped, stolen, recycled, or archived. It's rumored that some of the props from the great movie ride are kept at a storage facility near MCO, the Orlando International Airport. Patrick Spikes, the founder of the infamous Backdoor Disney, has an image of one of the Footlight Parade dancers. My guess is that this was taken on property in Walt Disney World in some storage facility, perhaps the one near MCO. Patrick Spikes is responsible for the robbery of Buzzy and props from the Haunted Mansion. So when Robin Lopez, a basketball player in the NBA, bought pieces from Spikes, he also obtained some props from the Great Movie Ride. It's unknown which props he bought specifically from the Great Movie Ride, but it does suggest that Spikes also stole props from the Great Movie Ride attraction. When Spikes' house was searched in 2018, there was a witness who claims he saw a bunch of Great Movie Ride props in Patrick's garage, including a dozen or so footlight parade dancers. There were also chimney sweeps from the Mary Poppins sequence that were spotted too. So I guess he stole the dancer in that picture, though I heard they were trashed. So maybe Spikes went dumpster diving and is innocent, at least for this specific case. The Burt animatronic from Mary Poppins was gifted to Dick Van Dyke himself, as shown in a recent political ad. This suggests that other animatronics were gifted to their respective actors or their families, but this doesn't seem to be the case because the John Wayne animatronic is apparently in a storage facility, and so is Julie Andrews's Mary Poppins animatronic. I guess Dick Van Dyke is special in this scenario. There are theories that say that the Wicked Witch animatronic was recycled into Red from Pirates of the Caribbean, and apparently Red's face is that of Jane's from the Tarzan scene, and some of the parts, the hand for example, are from the Wicked Witch. This is supported by the fact that Jane's and the Witch's animatronics were scrapped. So it's very likely that Red is both Jane and the Wicked Witch, and I'm honestly pretty surprised that Disney didn't archive the Wicked Witch because the animatronic was such a technological advancement for Disney, being their first A100 figure. The theory is that they recycled the inner workings, as I mentioned before, and archived the clothes and broom. Rumors say that the Ark of the Covenant, hidden in Doc Ondar's Den of Antiquities in Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, is actually the Ark from the Indiana Jones scene in The Great Movie Ride. It is also rumored that the foot outside of Doc Ondar's is that of one of the Anubises in The Great Movie Ride. Neither one of these rumors have been confirmed, but the Ark was removed because some people complain that it wasn't Star Wars. I personally loved this inclusion, I thought it was a fantastic easter egg, but some idiots just ruined that. So those are some of the whereabouts of some of the props from the great movie ride. That's not all of them of course, but this is just some of the ones that we know of. Have a magical day and a great big beautiful tomorrow. Thank <laughs> you.